Why? Because you're allowing your body to reset. And this one, oh, guys, I have grown up. All right. Anybody that's been following me for like mm, over two years, maybe three years, but for sure, oh, for sure three years, but probably over two years, knows that what I'm about to say next is about polar opposite to anything that I used to believe and do. Um, I used to be the, the guy that is uh, hustle, hustle, hustle. Work 18 hours a day, seven days a week. If you're not hustling, if you're not grinding, you're not getting ahead, you're wasting your time, you're not staying focused, you know, like work, 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 do the work, do the work, do the work, hustle all the time, constantly. That was my life, right? And many of you guys saw that. I have gone through tremendous changes in my life, tremendous growth, mentally, uh, emotionally, personally, like just in general. And um, one of the things that I have noticed that works really, really well for me when we when I do this, um, and actually probably the first time that I got introduced to it formally by someone was Taylor Welch, uh, his interview on Think Different Theory last season, season one. I believe he was the first interview that we ever did. But it is having dedicated off times, having dedicated times when you have off to do absolutely nothing. Um, this past Saturday, just two days ago, took the whole day off. I think I worked for an hour, maybe, um, if that. I uh, just kind of put some things in place and some pieces there. But then the rest of the day, I did nothing. It was 60-something degrees outside. I went for a walk. I laid in bed. I watched Netflix. I hung out with Leah. I went out to eat. Just did basically nothing all day. Took the entire day off to just unplug and reset. It was amazing. And you know what? I woke up on Sunday and I chose to work on Sunday and have Saturday off rather than vice versa. You do whatever you want. But on Sunday, it was a work day for me because Saturday was my day off. I was focused. I was energized. I got tons done. I got so, I was so, so focused. The reason that this works, not only is it like just natural, like we need rest, our bodies need rest. God created us that way. But there are actual low points in the energy cycles of your brain and of your body where Literally, your body will go and just be in a low energy state that day. And if you can match that and if you could actually go and be like, okay, I'm going to give my body that time to rest, it actually gives your body time to rest and reset so that the other five or six days a week, you can literally go and have the energy that you need to go and perform. Taylor Welch, uh, him and his salespeople actually do something really, really interesting. And I'd actually be curious to know if they still do this, but he shared this on the podcast in season one. He's like, we know that we need a weekend break. We need a day off to reset. But we also know that there are roughly once a week, every single week, uh, there is a, a half day that we know that our salesmen's bodies and, and you know even my body is going to have a low energy day. So we try to work that into the schedule and we try to be the ones that can choose when that's going to happen by kind of like forcing it to happen that way or like um, prompting it to go into that state of rest or low energy. And so Taylor was like every Wednesday morning is a, 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 a lazy morning for him. So Monday up at it, 6 a.m. out, boom, work, work, work. Tuesday up at it, uh, work, work, work. Wednesday, lay in bed, scroll on Instagram, sleep in late, relax, go into work at noon. Why? Because you're allowing your body to reset. And now productive Wednesday afternoon, productive Thursday, productive Friday, productive Saturday, off Sunday, right back at a Monday, Tuesday, have to, whatever that is. So it doesn't have to be Wednesday morning for you, but figure out for me, it's a, an entire day that I like to have that, or at least most of the day I can like maybe catch up on some emails and stuff, but then no hard work, no recording, no things like that. Go get out of the house, go do something, drive somewhere, take, you know, take a day trip, go to the mall, lay around and do nothing, watch Netflix, allow your body to just indulge in whatever it kind of wants to go do, obviously within, within reason, because your body needs that reward to reset because if you're constantly going and like keeping it all up, no, I, I can't do this. I can't do that. There's nothing wrong with watching Netflix, right? There's nothing wrong with taking time off and going for a walk and taking care of your body, spending time with family, you know, hanging out, doing whatever. It's just when that becomes a distraction and when that comes into your day every single day, it pulls you away from what you need to be doing.